This is an invisible fruit. Basically, while I was chilling on my private server, I randomly discovered a way to make fruits go invisible. Just like your time, and I feel like it can be a very good way to troll people. So in today's video, I will be trolling random people, my friends, and I will even attempt to troll an admin with it. So stick around to see that, and enjoy. Okay, so basically I just decided to go to the second sea because it feels more active compared to the third sea. So for that reason, I will continue on second sea for a while, then go to the third sea. Anyway, so I just rolled up fruit, and it's a ghost fruit. So I will quickly make the fruit invisible, then we will continue with the trolling. Alright, as you can see, the fruit is now invisible, let me just... Okay, this is very suspicious, but we don't talk about that, okay, thank you. So, now that the fruit is invisible, I can finally start the troll and just troll people. So, basically, what I will be doing is, I will tell people that I'm doing a challenge, and if they can tell the fruit I'm holding, they will win a dragon fruit. But as you can tell, this is uh, this is actually ghost fruit, you know, like, this is 100% real ghost fruit. Okay, does anyone want to compete in a challenge with a dragon prize? I mean, dragon fruit prize. So let's see if anyone wants to compete in a challenge. Okay, so I just explained him and basically I will be holding a fruit. And the first person who says the name of the fruit I'm holding is going to win the dragon fruit. <laughs> Let me just hold it. <laughs> Alright, here. <laughs> What's this fruit? Bro said Buddha, I mean it's close enough. Okay, now I'm in the private server of this dude, which I will mention on the next video about who he, he is. And for something specific that he did, I'm going to troll him as well. Uh, oh god damn. Okay, maybe I'm not going to troll him. Okay, n I never thought I wanted to smash Gojo anyway. <laughs> okay, so I will quickly make the fruit invisible again. I should be able to just troll for a fruit. Like Oh boy, this is going to hurt if it doesn't work. Okay, it's. I will take this fruit later, so let me just drop it to this corner over here. Okay, now, I feel like you can guess it. I will just tell him that I, ha I hid a fruit around here somewhere, so I will just tell him to find it. <laughs> never mind, never mind, nothing's happening in chat. I, I want to forget everything. Anyways, I hid a fruit in mansion. Find it and you will get free leopard. Okay, basically that's it. I just hit the fruit. I hit the phoenix fruits and I will just tell him to just look around. And if he finds it, he gets a fruit. Okay, that's a smart move actually. I'm not really sure if he thinks that... Okay, he didn't got it. That's very surprising because the fruit was right there. And he didn't got it. Yes, inside only, brother. So like, so far it has been 4 minutes and Brostal hasn't gave up. I can go for 5 hours straight, god damn! <laughs> Who knows, I mean, you would never know if it's actually... Like a invisible fruit glitch. Ready to give up, brother? Discord is my answer. Wait, what? What did he say? Well, I... <laughs> okay, good luck. GG's. I mean, took him around like 15 minutes or so, but he still got it. So that's the cool thing, I guess. Okay, for our next trolling, I have decided to gaslight my friend into thinking the fruit is not actually invisible. You know, as a very good friend. But before I could do so, I randomly got a kitsu fruit from Zeolas. You get that? <laughs> what? Huh? <laughs> no! Okay, so a little bit of problem, the budget for this video just went to somewhere else, so we will have to do this in public server. We're no longer has a private server, that's sad. Okay. Alright, so what are we, what are we doing? Yeah, I'm glad you asked me, what, where are you going? I'm jumping around. <laughs> yeah, it's like a little monkey. Anyway, calm down here. Oh, there are you! <laughs> okay, anyways. So, L. Yes. 
That is me. So basically, in a second I will be holding a fruit. And if you can guess which fruit it is, you will get the kitsune fruit as a reward. Are you ready? Oh, is there like 20 of them? Are you ready? All right. Yes. Okay, here. That's uh, what the fuck? Yeah, hey, I'm holding the fruit right now. You don't see it? <laughs> no. Hey, wait, what? <laughs> it's, it's just invisible. <laughs> Bro. Brother, how bad is your computer? What the hell? Excuse me, it's not my computer. What do you I swear, mean? I will. I will literally send you. I will literally send you a screenshot. Stand still. I, I, I see the fruit in my hand. Bro. <laughs> what? <laughs> just look at my stream. You're in holding shit! Like, actually, like, take it. Bro. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Yeah. For the next clip, I tried to troll an admin of Black Fruits. I'm serious. Basically, I saw Fod's message on YouTuber only chat, and I have decided to join him for the fun. And surprisingly, I did join him on my first try. Right as I was about to catch up to him and beg for the equal to the heavens title, he ran away. You know, we just dipped like that. You know, it's it's not something I don't mind, you know, like... <laughs> I still went up to the Red Legion hideout, though. It had a cool throne where I just sat. I hope nothing bad happens to me because of staying this throne, you know, like... And also, here's more of the hideout if you were curious about, like, what it looks like. And then, he went to somewhere different. And as a little stalker I am, I chased him there too. And even though he had around 30,000 level and still somewhat killable because he wasn't necessarily attacking you, I still, I didn't risk it since if I die, I have to go all the way up again and I don't want to do that. Then he asked about the strongest first C boss, which I replied with Greybeard because I suppose that's the strongest one. And uh, I mean to be honest it was easy match for me because I was level like 2550 while the boss was just like 750 level so I mean you know it wasn't fair match to begin with but still I don't care. And then he asked about strongest second C boss, which everyone already replied with Blackbeard so I didn't have to reply with anything. But I was aware what he was going to do so I activated the Buddha form and gave Get ready for the fight. And so, me and the other dude completely destroyed Blackbeard, like it was also very easy match. And then, he spawned Indra. No, not the Indra boss where you spawn with Chalice. The Indra where you have to kill to get to the third sea. Which is coded to be unkillable without like 12 Buddhas or something because you know you don't like what you are supposed to do is just get his level low and like and then the cutscene plays. But I had a very brilliant idea to kill it. So you see, while Fod doesn't attack, he still has his best of friend out. So if we can get Indra to attack him, his best of friend can beat him up. And it exactly went like that. The best $3 and 2 XP of my life. Next up we were at Red Legion Arena, where he literally spawned Doking, which we also just bullied quickly because you know there were lots of people. It's also there where I managed to get personally close with Fud. That's also where I had the idea to ask him about Invisible Fruit Glitch, which he didn't respond of. Uh, very cool. But I still decided to show it to him when he teleported to a whole different area. So I quickly made the fruit invisible and went straight to him. But unfortunately, there were no way of me getting inside unless he would teleport me inside with the commands. Like, I'm serious, I tried every corner of that thing, but no, you just couldn't get in without comments. And I still tried to get in until I just got disconnected and I just didn't have any other choice but to leave. Yeah, sad ending. But hey, what's even more sadder is, with that, it's my fifth admin where I couldn't get the equal to the heavens title from. Yeah! Okay, as of right now, we have surpassed 6 minute mark of the video. For, so for that reason, since you have been tortured enough with my shitty ass editing, I have decided to let you know how to do invisible fruit glitch. Okay, so the first thing is you should be able to drop the fruit. It can't be something that you stored in your inventory, so like all of these fruit, you can't do it with those. It should be something that you can drop, because you'll see. So just let me do a gacha. Okay, I got chop fruit, it should anyway. Make sure to do it in some spot where you will remember afterwards because yes. So basically, you will hold the fruit in your hand and you will just reset and just keep using backspace to just drop the fruit and not take it. And right after you do that, just go to the area where you drop the fruits and boom, the, the fruit is now invisible. I'm not sure how you can do it on the mobile, so good luck figuring that out, but that's basically how I found it out. 
Anyways, let's continue with trolling. Okay, so for my next trolling, I'm not going to troll only one person. Instead, I'm going to troll multiple people. I have a Discord server, which you should join by the way. There is this Rufy dude, which does lots of giveaways. So, join to the server. You may, you might participate in the permanent T-Rex giveaway or something. So, you might win it. You know, join. I just said I will be doing a quick giveaway as well. And... There's like six people waiting, so I shouldn't take it that long. And the price is going to be two leopard. And basically, <laughs> you know, I have the fruit in my inventory. So I will just quickly make it invisible. And just do that real quick. Okay, now let me just take them. Okay. <laughs> so basically, I will just drop this fruit on the mansion and just I mean, to tell them to find it. And if they find, if someone somehow finds it, they will be a fruit. Okay, this spot should be good. And I hope the fruit just... Did I actually just lost the fruit? Like, right off the bat? Uh, a little bit of technical problems. <laughs> what? Where did the fruit go? P please tell me you can do a spin. Please tell me you can do a spin. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Bro thinks I just like betrayed this fruit right now. Okay. Uh, I will drop it to a better area. Like, to this corner over here. Okay, this should be good. Okay, yeah. Let me just put it over here. Alright, now it's time to just get people in. You will have 10 minutes to find it. That's now. Okay, I just sent the server, so now it's time for time to wait. <laughs> Rufi, come up here. Okay, I just told him to check giveaway channel so he can know what's going on. So, yes. Okay, okay, we have our first person to join, Sil. Sil? Or how do you say Celeste YouTuber? Yes, he's also another YouTuber. Let's hope he doesn't get banned for having like YouTuber in his name because they do that. I mean, I specifically said it's mention only. Oh shit! Oh wait, no. <laughs> my bad, my bad. I just got the name wrong. It's <laughs> it's cafe only. So, so far it has been 4 minutes and there are still 6 minutes to go. I mean like the only way for them to just like get the fruit and like just take it off the ground is to just accidentally go touch it because it's an invisible fruit like. Okay, it's cafe only. I kinda have to remind them because where, where are they going? I mean I know they are going to be confused because it's an invisible fruit. And like they will just look at every inch of the like mansion and there will be nothing. I mean this is kind of right but the, the fruit is invisible so this doesn't count obviously. I mean there is people who are just checking like th these rails. I mean it was the first area where I decided to do it. Also I have no idea what I'm going to do if they just like get the falcon fruit as well. I mean it's there somewhere so they there's still a possibility they, they can get it. Okay he's checking like the uh, Van Lok Toad's room I guess that's what they called. Yes, yeah, this great area. I mean, it's smart, but yeah, it's not here. Okay, it's last five minutes, so I will just tell them it's a. Uh, I mean, should I just tell them it's an invisible fruit so they they can? Oh, okay, bros, using Kitsun, so like it has kind of a bigger hit point, I I would say. So that might be the play. <laughs> oh, she told on it. Just okay, I will. <laughs> okay, let me just take him to take the fruit from him. Yeah, the funny thing is like there were also flame downstairs, which was also invisible, but I lost Falcon while doing it. Okay, yeah, Kella Pacha has won this one. <laughs> Alright, let's real quick trade with him. Anyone who can win a one winner I guess me gets a permanent ice. Anyways, I mean it really depends on if this dude wants to split split or just get everything for himself and I feel like yeah he's <laughs> taking it for himself. Alright, and GG's with that, I kinda lost lots of fruits. I mean, how many? Okay, I still have 11 leopards. Anyway, never mind. 
And yes, GG is to the <laughs> GG is to Umut for finding invisible falcon fruits. And I wasn't expect them. I I didn't expect them to find the fruit that fast. But I guess it's it's me being that dumb to just drop the falcon there. But anyways, GGs. And with that, the video is finally over. I mean, I tried to make it as enjoyable as I could because. I mean, the, as a video concept, it's cool, you know, it's an invisible fruit, I'm trolling people, etc. But it's it was very hard to think of different trolling methods, and it still got repetitive, but anyway. But if you have watched this far, why not you just, like, don't like and subscribe? Like, why? You know, you have watched a full 15-minute video. Whoa. Like and subscribe, okay? Okay, thank you. Thank you. And comment, because I, I need that. that. Yes. Okay, anyways, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see all of you in the next one.